The kids showed up en masse as expected and then some. Just a clear indication of the pent-up enthusiasm and energy of the youth bubbling over after more than two and a half years of being kept at home due to the pandemic. PTV's Ryan Lesigas took his team to a school in the capital to find out exactly what it looked like on day one of Balik Escuela, and he filed this report. This is what the scene used to be in schools during break time before the pandemic hit the country. The school canteens were full of students. Students used to gather also outside the school to buy food. But the situation is different this first day of face-to-face -face classes after more than two years. Here at Manuel G. Araulio High School in Ermita, Manila, the school canteens were not allowed to open. According to the principal of Manuel G. Araulio High School, Maria Eva Cachon, children are not allowed to leave the classroom during break time or recess to avoid the crowding of students. Siyempre, iniiwasan po natin yung madalas o uh, naggagala yung mga bata kasi siyempre, in case na meron talagang magkaroon ng problema, no, let's say ma magiging malagnatin yung bata at tumuloy nga, ano, at least classroom lang muna kung sakasakaling talagang meron. And then after that, kung talagang medyo lumaki, so building lamang ang affected, hindi yung entire school, parang ganun. It was after 5 a.m. this morning when the students started to arrive here, some of them with their parents. Before entering the classrooms, the students first went through the temperature check and wash area. No face mask, no entry too. In the classrooms, social distancing is strictly enforced. Some parents are satisfied with the layout of health protocols. Sa susunod na mga araw, pag alimbawa hindi ko na siya hinahatid, sabi ko pag may kausap siyang iba na hindi niya kakilala, o siya makikipag-usap. Yun lang ang mga binibiling ko. Meron po, face mask, alcohol, sanitizer, meron po lahat. Tsaka nap at tissue. Excited din ako. Parang sa kanila din, excited din sila pumasok ng face to face. Sabi ko sa kanila, uh, mag-aaral kayong maigi at uh, wag kayong, pa, ano, yung, kayong pasaway sa teacher nyo. According to the local government of Manila, parents should not worry because health protocols are strict in city schools. The LGU also prepared for the opening of face-to-face -face classes. Manila Mayor Honey Lacuna Pangan said that in 107 schools in Manila, each one has an isolation room in case needed. May isolation rooms po tayo dito. Uh, may naka-allocate po dito sa Aralyo na isang isolation room. Meron naman po tayo mga uh, medical uh, frontliners na nandito po. And magpapalagay din po tayo dito ng uh, vaccination team just in case po na meron pang gusto magpabakuna. Ryan Lee Siges for The Nation.